A Sacramento County expectant mom faces a serious health crisis in her third trimester. I started getting a lot more problems with my heart. Coming up, the condition that forced her to get a pacemaker and how doctors protected her unborn baby. New at six, fatigue and shortness of breath. Some symptoms may many women feel late in pregnancy, but for a Carmichael woman, it was signs of a life-threatening heart problem. Yeah, and surgery, as you might imagine, was risky, but as Case Area 3's Richard Sharp shows us tonight, it was the only option for the safety of both the mom and her baby. He just woke up. <laughs> One and a half month old Luke Gerhardt keeps his mom on her toes. Oh, can you say hi? <laughs> but it's the pacemaker in Teresa Gerhardt's body that keeps her healthy enough to keep up with the demands of motherhood. He's changing every day and, you know, starting to coo and, you know, recognizing you and smiling. Diagnosed with a heart problem in her early 20s, the situation became critical when she was around six and a half months pregnant. I started getting a lot more problems with my heart as far as fast heart rate and just not feeling well. Suffering from an irregular heartbeat and with no other options, Gerhardt was fitted with a pacemaker. To actually do it during the course of pregnancy, I think Teresa may be the first one I've done. Dr. Garrod O'Neill, an electrophysiologist with Mercy General in Sacramento, performed the operation, a first in his career. We're essentially dealing with two patients during pregnancy. And uh, anything that we do, we have to consider what effect it might have on the baby as well. Dr. O'Neill had to use x-rays to guide him to Gerhardt's heart. Protecting young Luke from radiation exposure was critical. So we protect, the shield the baby from radiation exposure. But other than that, the procedure is pretty much the same procedure. Six weeks after the operation, on New Year's Day, Luke entered the world eight pounds and perfectly healthy. I just feel like I have a new lease on life, too, and in a way that, that Luke, um, you know, helped save me. I'm Richard Sharp, KCRA 3 Reports. The nice stories. Cutie, isn't he? Yeah, he is. He's, he's going to be a handful.